Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Factorio Ditech here with Oni. And hey guys. Uh, yeah. All right, so, so uh, let's see. Last time I was working on getting the automation finished and set up for accumulators because our main problem we have right now is that every time we get attacked, our power turns off, basically. Yeah, pretty much. So, so hmm. I am at and the I'm point where I am finished with weak flux capacitors. I just need batteries and iron to be over here, too. All righty. Oh, yeah, and I think last time you had asked what we were doing last time. Uh, I think we are both trying to work on iron as well. Oh, iron yeah. In. I just fixed the copper. Apparently there was a belt that was still dead, so that would have caused some problems. Yeah. Iron seems... Oh, uh, yeah, we are kind of running out a little bit. A little bit. Um, All right. I mean, we could. It's going to be hard to fit any more in here without really rearranging stuff. We uh, could. Uh, we, we, we could. I mean, we, we could move the stuff back, like sort of move this thing, the whole thing back a little bit. Mm hmm. And move all these chests out of the way and just add more smelteries or add more uh, furnaces. Alrighty. Yeah, I can do <clears> that if, if you want to work on your thing. Sure. And then uh, last, it was either the last episode or the episode before that, I made two tanks. So once we get all this oh, done, we can go, that's right. go kill some stuff. Sweet. All right, let me just uh, do that. I don't think I need to do that long, but we'll see. So uh, it should just be kind of like that, actually. Alrighty, so iron's going to stop for a minute, just to let you know. Sure. Actually, I'm already doing iron over here, so I could just, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move the stone a little bit more. Yeah, it's kind of in the way. Yeah. How far are you deleting? Um, just to there? Just to where this belt, yeah, All just right. to there. I'm going to actually move it towards, like, actually almost hugging the other line. Okay. So I have more room in the horizontal direction. Actually, uh, no, we don't. I was looking at this. Oh, you do have um, deconstruction planners. Oh, nice. I'll just pick it up manually, though, for right now. All right. Okay. All righty. This should give us quite a bit more room, I would think. Oh wait, this thing needs stone. I forgot. No big deal. All right, so let's see. How are you feeling today? You feeling better today? Uh, yeah, I can actually thank. <laughs> yeah, that's always How good. How about you? <laughs> oh yeah. I'm just gonna split it off again. Just go to the left here because I need stone for those sand walls. So. And I guess I better move some of these chests. Alright, uh, that means I could probably... I could probably actually use storage chests, but... What, you mean, like, for logistics? Yeah, just to put all this, like, junk in. Well, which chest is that? Wooden chest? That's like... Uh, except for the sand walls. Oh, no, no, sorry, these are all, like, damaged walls, so I'll just blow it up. Alright. There we go. Thousand limestone, if we ever want to, uh mess with that. Yeah, we right, haven't really so. done that much more with the road stuff yet. Probably yeah, should get we on haven't. That. <laughs> Although I started Ardite processing, which apparently takes forever, so. Whoops, but it's also one of the things that you need uh, to, like, pretty much do anything else. Uh, I, yeah. I did see some Ardite, like, uh, around and about in some places. I, I can't remember exactly where it was, but I do remember seeing it. Hmm. Okay, well, we'll have to find that. We also have to find lead, I think. We yeah. needed that for some stuff. All right, so. It's being destroyed. Oh, we're good. You know what? Just... Oh, wow. No power. <laughs> Not enough or no, none at all? It just spikes. You know, oh, yeah. I'm getting attacked. Okay, where is basic smart, basic close inserted? Ooh, what's yeah, being that's better. killed? 
like every once in a while the spitters will kill one of the turrets, but luckily um, most of them are in range of the construction bots to replace them. Oh, okay. Well, Except the ones good. up here. I'll, just, I'll, I'll come up here and do this manually for right now until we get a bigger uh, robot port set up. Like they'll kill one every couple waves, and over time it gets you get down a little pretty low. Oh, right. Yeah, makes sense. Also, I also want to see. Can I move this miner? Yeah. Do we have? Well, why are these guys? What the hell are these guys doing? Which ones? These construction robots are like lined oh, up. Oh, they don't have anywhere to go. Line. That's right. I forgot. So I'll make a storage chest. Sorry. Oh, uh, okay. You had them de. Okay, I see. Yeah, I had them deconstruct that, and then I have anywhere to put it. So I'll just put a storage chest somewhere. Yeah. Right. They kind of just hover there until they like run out of power. <laughs> you don't have yeah. anywhere to put them. Um, huh. Cool. There's our a nice little line. Oh, there it is. I'll just put it right here for right now. Um, are we? Do we have inserters being made like for us? Did we ever uh, do that? I don't think so. But now that we have logistics bots, we can probably set that up to where they put into a chest somewhere and then de delivered to us True. in certain amounts. Okay, I might deal with that once I uh, finish this up. Hopefully, this will help. All right. So I want to do this instead. I think. Uh, and then got that. Sweet. Iron, you're making accumulators. I guess at some point, <laughs> it's going to be a pain, but at some point we should set up like automation for like frames and stuff so we don't have to like manually make that forever. Yeah, it's like, but <laughs> it's one of those things that like you feel like you need to do, but it's like you just don't like the idea of it. <laughs> you're like, oh, I got to do this. Yeah, but then. No thanks. Yeah, you mean, but it'll be worth it later on. So you're right. We should probably get on that. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if there's a huge rush, but how much? These are what five batteries each. So this is enough for what forty accumulators. Ah, uh, there you go. I'll put a uh, just for right now. I can put a chest here that just has batteries in it. Alrighty. Uh, yeah, there we go. No oh, god. <laughs> And, um, hmm. So, maybe, do we need to add more steam power even, too? Uh, if you look at our steam power now, it does spike up quite a bit, so adding more steam power might be a good idea. So, I guess after I'm done with the accumulators, I'll do that. Okay. Uh, do we get substations, too, yet? I think we did. I Here think we, we have Sweet. them, yeah. All right, so, I want to put these into a, I'll just put them into a regular chest for right now. I think they're over there killing your your old uh, zinc zinc farm. Oh yeah, they let them chew on that. They can have as much fun as they want. Oh yeah. Alrighty, so I added, I think four or six more, which means we'll probably need more miners. So I'll go ahead and do that. Why are okay? And our power. Yeah, it really just spikes. I mean, normally it's we're doing fine. Yeah, it just spikes up a lot and. All the engines are like, holy shit, and they can't keep up, though. Yeah, so if we just put a lot of accumulators, like, do you know, because um, I don't know how this works, like, if we get attacked and it takes, like, will it take power from the accumulators for the lasers first, or will it drain our steam engines and then do that? Uh, I don't exactly know how the priority works. I just know that if there's not enough power from the main engines that, or actually, I think the accumulators will dump out First, I don't know. All I know is that they'll help out okay, as, well, as much as they can. But right now we only have like 10 of them, and each of them can only right. output uh, 300 kilowatts. So having more would definitely be, be beneficial. Um, oh, so yeah, I'm going sure. to make uh, one of these guys. I'm missing what? Wood? Really? Okay. Let's, we should uh, have a ton somewhere. I yeah, we have, our... we have a farm. So. Okay. Yeah, I forgot we set a farm up for normal wood. All right, so I'm going to make, we do have one, two, three, seven, eight, make two more for that. And then I'll actually also, actually we do have a lot more pumps now, so I should be able to tack on a lot more engines on this thing too. Yeah, are we, um, wonder, is this science just take forever? Yeah, it does. Yeah, okay. the Ardite make takes, um, let's see, I, th I think I said last time, it's it's 100, cycle, it's 100 seconds per cycle, Good and gosh. it's 250 cycles. That is a lot. Which divided by uh, what? How many? We have ten labs, so it's still a lot. Even divided by ten. Yeah. 
I mean, we, once we get comfortable with our power, we can start making secondary engines, which will only turn on when the when the primary ones aren't enough. Right. So that could be a good idea too. Right, so is, is that how those actually work? Yeah, the secondaries will fire off when the primaries aren't pushing enough power through for the demand, and the tertiaries will fire off when the secondaries aren't pushing enough through. Okay, but like normally, the secondary and tertiary don't do anything. Yeah, they're just turned off. They're not using any water. Not using any fuel. That's uh, that's really nice. Yeah, I really like <laughs> like it a lot. Um. Okay, so each one of these can do how much again? Each one of these can do 1.2 megawatts as opposed to the 673 that normal ones can. Okay. And I don't know if that line will be able to push that much through. So, actually, you know what? Each line can push 10 of them. All right. Let me add just three more. Who cares? Wow, these, uh, these, whatchamacallit things, these. Weak flux capacitors are so pretty, nice and purple. I know, they're all nice looking, and they look like they're like really expensive, but, well, they are kind of expensive, but they look like they're really high tier stuff, but they're like the lowest of the low, almost. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> compared to a lot of the other stuff. Can I afford to make a, yeah, I can make a substation, because I stole a bunch of those red circuits one time. Let me also make another wooden chest, junk. Alrighty, so, um, right, what did we need to do next? Uh, you had more miners, right? Yeah, I added four more, or two more. I can okay. add two more as well that I have. Yeah, we could research the next level of miners. Oh, uh, yeah. That's, that's, that that's a thing. You know, hold on, hang on, they're destroying the wall down there. Let me go down there and help that out. Okay. And let's go ahead and power these guys on. Uh, What is this guy waiting for? Regular engines? All right. Oh, this guy's, these guys are trying to, like, bring me uh, iron, but, like, I'm too fast. I walk faster than they do, so. <laughs> like, come back. All right, let me put some engines in here. Uh, there you go. Whoops, that's not engine. Let's see. Um, hmm, so someone made a comment in the latest video on my channel. Um, they suggested a mod, which I've used before, which would be really cool, uh, called, what's it called? Like resource monitor, do you use that mm -hmm. at all? I've heard of it. I don't remember exactly what it does. I'm assuming that it monitors your resources. <laughs> yeah, it's really nice. Like you, it's like you research it, but it's really cheap, and you it puts a little device in your inventory, and then you like can click on an ore patch, and it uh -huh. like tells you exactly how much is in there, and then like how fast it's depleting, and you can have like do that with like all of them, like oil too, and just have a list. And it will like pop up when they're like running out. Oh, that's that's pretty neat. Yeah. So. Oh, I might, might look into that. Yeah, it'd be pretty cool. And uh, so, so I can I the... add what? Go ahead. I was gonna say, can I add these accumulators? I took like twenty-five of them. Uh, you can add them. I'm, I'm gonna move them anyway because um, I have a substation that's being that's queued up to build, and the substation can is a lot better layout for those anyway. So. All right, I'll just wait till you build that then. Uh, I'm going down here to fix this real quick. Uh, so, what was destroyed over here? Okay. Uh, maybe I will make some more steam engines as well. I have three, I have four queued up right now. Oh, okay. Well, I'll uh, make you, yeah, you can make some well. more too. I mean, more the better. <clears throat> yep, can't hurt. Can't hurt. And let's see. Let's see, this is limestone. We don't need limestone. We need lead, like you said. Yeah, and I don't even know what it looks like, like on the map. I'm guessing it probably blends in with everything else. <laughs> yeah, there's all these different colored specs. Put this down. It might actually be this stuff over here. Yeah. And then uh, once we get all this made, uh, do you want to go attack some stuff? Yeah, let's take a, take a think out and see how it is. Watch us die like horrible, horrible deaths. <laughs> like, we're so <laughs> yeah. good we have tanks, and then we just immediately get annihilated. Yeah, that's happened to me before. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's par for the course, so. Got little overzealous. There we go. So, one. These ta things take absolutely two, forever to make. Three. Just keep an eye on the water levels. Good. All right. I don't Can this even support more that I'm making, I wonder? This pump system and boiler system? Yeah, should be able to because we have we have multiple pumps and temperature is doing okay, ninety seven, ninety eight, on oh, ninety five okay. here. But 
if anything, we can add, we can always add another row of boilers to keep an eye on it. Now that we have more engines on it. True. Okay. All righty. All right, there we go. So, did you have substations in your inventory or something? Uh, I have not substations. Sorry, yeah. accumulators. Yeah. So, um, I just I don't think I start crying. I don't know. But now that we have all those extra steam engines. We should be able to break this and not be able to not have anything die on us. So let's put down this. Uh, yeah, I would hope so. Of course, this is a temporary spot. It can, you can move later on if you wanted to. And just kind of just do the rows. Alrighty. Oops. Oops, don't box me in. <laughs> oh, damn. I was trying to damn trap it. you. <laughs> and then we use a large one to hook it up like that. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I knew what you were going to do. <laughs> damn it. Go back in there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's all I had. But that's a lot of stored energy, I think. Let's see. Yep. 178 megajoules. Why are you saying this? Uh, you, if you click on the, the power pole, you see like your accumulator capacity. Third row, third uh, third bar. Uh, mine doesn't show accumulators. What? Like at the top like left? Like in the electric network info? Yeah, like it goes consumption, production, and accumulator capacity. Nope. You don't see that? <laughs> no, mine doesn't show that. I swear to God. You're lying. No, I'm not. You can, like, watch the video. It shows consumption, production, and it just shows our two different steam engines. Uh, Maybe it, like, doesn't for the second player? That's weird. Hang on. Pick up the big power pole and you put it down. All right. Same spot. Now, if I okay, now it, it shows for me. Okay, there we go. So now it shows me, too. So I don't know what that was about, but... Wow, that's weird. Okay. And, and I have how one many more, steam more? Engine. 18 more. Let me just fill out that whole thing. Of course, the robots are sad because they're too slow to catch up to me and they want to give me iron. <laughs> Oops. Hmm. Weird. We might need more, like, small pumps or whatever, because, like, these engines near the back, or actually most of them, the water fluctuates a lot. Yeah, um... I don't even know if more small pumps would help. We could probably go for the next level pump if we need to. Do we have um, them? No, we haven't, we haven't got it yet. But I also think we should probably add a little bit, another row of boilers. Alright, I'm going to add some more small pumps as well. Maybe that'll help. Uh, yeah, you can try. And then I'm going to um, add another row of boilers, boilers on the other side. Alright, I'm going to... Let me just plop this down the other side so it doesn't start, everybody doesn't start crying at the same time. Um, <laughs> okay, now I can break this. And this. Yes. And ten of these guys. So. Oops, that's not right. That's not right. See, I'm, I'm glad that they're, like, up there attacking your old zinc area, but at the same time, they're really annoying. Yeah, they are. What the hell did I just do? What? I broke something. Uh, no, you didn't. Uh, I did something that messed it up. The... Oh, yeah, you did. I don't know. The water's, like, really... What the hell's wrong with this thing? Like, look at this. Uh, oh, no, it's fine now. It's getting back to the point where it's fine. No, but then it goes, like, way down. I think we need to see... Uh, okay, has, let's try this. Put put the put a pump... Like, you see the, the the pipe to the left of me that I'm running into? Yeah. Put a pump that faces down there. Like that? Like that, yeah. That's so weird. I don't understand. They were working. I think it's just the, level, the pump level itself. Um... Yeah, it can't and then move put like water. how many? How many do you have on you? Um, quite a few. All right, but put one like uh, like right here, facing down. Okay, that's only like okay, that's only for this side of the steam engines, though, right? Right. Uh oh. 
it like doesn't do anything. Uh, break it, break it, and put a pipe down in there instead, because we just killed the water to survive for the second, the, 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 the lower one left. Um, Maybe we just need stronger ones. I yeah, don't know, that's really weird. Pumps, yeah. I mean, it's not like our power's doing bad right now, it's just that it'd be doing better. Well, the water. Keep, keep the water level up. I don't get it. Alright, um, but actually, we are out of time. So, okay. I'll do the outro. Alright. All right, so like always, guys, uh, this has been Oni and Exterminator with another episode of DiTech Multiplayer. We're going to work on this water thing real quick, and uh, hopefully next time we'll have that resolved. But as always, we thank you for watching, and we'll uh, see you next time. All see you.